Human robots are getting wild, and they're already among us. A robot mid-demo suddenly lashes out at engineers. Another one's dancing in a car showroom. And a third? You can 3D print it at home. Humanoids aren't coming. They're already here, and they're not asking permission. Robots are crossing the line from impressive to unsettling. One recent demo turned chaotic when a humanoid bot malfunctioned and started flailing violently, sending engineers scrambling. That clip went viral, but it's just one piece of a much bigger story. In China, security footage showed a half-assembled humanoid suspended from a crane for a motion test. Two engineers monitored its movements until every joint suddenly surged. The bot spun its limbs, kicked, and dragged its stand across the floor. A PC crashed, parts scattered, and the engineers backed off fast. The chaos lasted 20 seconds, but sparked thousands of views and memes comparing it to Skynet and Robocop. Cherry Automotive is taking a different route, Charm. They've introduced Moran, a humanoid sales robot with sunglasses and a ponytail, into showrooms. Built with AI MOA, Moran can hand out water, answer questions, and even dance. Its eyes hide a 360-degree camera, and its fingers sense touch. The robot costs about as much as a car, and hundreds are already on order. In Cologne, Iggy GmbH has built a humanoid focused on efficiency. Iggy Rob doesn't walk. It's mounted on a wheeled base. It features robotic arms and hands made from low-friction polymers. Priced at around $54,500, it's cheaper than most competitors. It runs for eight hours, navigates with LiDAR, and integrates with existing factory systems. Companies can test it before committing to a purchase. UC Berkeley has released a $5,000 humanoid that you can build at home. It's small, made from 3D printed parts, and powered by affordable hardware. Despite its size, it can walk, gesture, and perform simple tasks. The software was trained in simulation and transferred directly to the robot. Reddit users are split. Some call it revolutionary, others say it looks outdated. But the open source design is already being modified by hobbyists. Hyundai is integrating Boston Dynamics Atlas robots into its new factory in Georgia. The goal, produce 300,000 electric cars annually. Atlas can navigate human design spaces, making it ideal for mixed environments. Though labor unions are concerned, Hyundai believes the robots will improve safety and productivity. The future factory may feature humans, Atlas bots, and robotic arms working side by side, with robots now selling cars, building them, and occasionally glitching out. How long before one takes your job? Drop your thoughts in the comments, hit like, and subscribe for more.